Hello folks, Clyde Lindsay here from Pixel Pro Displays. Thank you for joining us in this very short tips and tricks video. So many of you have already seen the brand new Mesmerizer spinner from uh, Boscoyo Studios. Now, uh, one of the great things about this is it's a beautiful, awesome prop that has endless opportunities for programming. It only has 1,117 pixels, so your fingers aren't going to hurt after this one. But I guarantee that this is going to be an exciting addition into your brand new display this year. So uh, what I want to do is I want to show you how we're going to wire this, uh, this bad boy up and cue an intro and we're going to get started. Okay, well let's go ahead and get started. You can see here on the bottom of the screen, we have what's called the layer sizes for the Mesmerizer. We know that it has 1117 bullet nodes, but what we need to know, which is more important, is this layer size chart, which we will copy, right click and copy. Uh, if you're on a Mac, I don't know how you do that. Um, but basically these are the layer sizes. We're going to go into x lights and we'll go into the modeling process now. Uh, we will come up here onto the layout tab. We'll hover over top of this create new circles. We'll click it one time and click and drag it out on the main screen here. And then what we'll do is we will add in where it says nodes per string, 1,117 nodes per string. We're gonna change the center to one which is 1% center. And now we're going to add in our layer sizes. Now, uh, you can't right click and paste, so we'll hit the Control and V keys. If you have a Mac, I don't know if the Command and V paste, it may, you may try it, I don't know. Um, so basically, out of the gates, that's as easy as it is to create the actual model. Now you want to see how we're going to wire this thing so that you can begin playing it. Well, as soon as I click off of this model, you're going to see it fills in very nicely. That's the perfect mesmerizer right there. x lights builds it phenomenally. We are going to use the standard default clockwise direction of wiring where it will start at the bottom outer. And here is the bottom outer point right here. This is pixel number one. And when it says CW, that's clockwise, we're going to go in this direction around it. Now, if you'd like to see the back side, so this is the front side. This is the side that everybody sees that has the pixels poking out of it. What, what we want to do is we want to look at the back side. So to do that, we'll hover over the model, we'll right click, and we'll go to wiring view. Once we do that, we can come out here and drag this screen out and we can see right here right away this is the reverse view so this here is the view uh, within your display uh, as a uh, viewer would see it from your house and this here display would be the view from which standing behind the prop uh, looking sort of looking out like your, your your viewers are on the other side of the prop back there in the background and this would be your first pixel number one on the outside and standing behind you're going to go in a counterclockwise direction even though even though we said we're going in a clockwise direction here this clockwise means that on the front side it's going in a clockwise direction so this is how we're going to uh, set up and uh, this is how we prefer that you set up and wire your your uh, mesmerizer is to start here in the bottom center and go in a counterclockwise direction and as you end it you'll move inward and you'll keep going around in that circle you'll move inward again and that that's that's a real easy that's the easiest way we could come up with the model to do it um, uh, rest assured that uh, James and I are going to be working very closely together to create some really, really wonderful, uh, uh, I mean, even if we condense this down to a four foot size prop, look, I, I mean, that thing is just going to be very glorious in your display. So uh, if you can imagine, these are his uh, standard 46 inch uh, mega spinners. You can, you can imagine that the Mesmerizer is going to have a significant number more uh, some models and cool things that we're going to work with James on and uh, really punch up some cool programming and effects coming in the near future. So just want to get you started with this, folks. Uh, like this video if you liked it. Share it with everybody if you loved it. Remember to hit the big red subscribe button down below as well as the bell for notifications. Comments down below if you have any questions. And also, if you appreciate the content that we put out here at Pixel Pro Displays, by all means, consider joining one month of the PPD Sequence Club where you'll get one awesome sequence. You'll also get access to awesome discounts from vendors such as Boscoyo Studios, 
uh, Wired Watts, and a number of other affiliate members here at the PPD Affiliate Group. Discounts every month on different things that you're already going to buy, including pixels. There's lots of pixels in there too. Um, so we'll leave it right there, folks. Thank you for joining us, and we will see you in the next video.